Welcome my dear friends. In this video, we'll show you the easiest way to access banking apps in rooted Android device. This is one of the errors that I'm getting, and some of my financial apps don't even open. Let's go ahead and fix. Step 1. Disable USB debugging. Please open settings. Go to system. Advanced. Developer options. Scroll down and disable USB debugging. I would even recommend you to disable developer options altogether. Step 2. Hide Magisk. Please open Magisk app. Well, if you don't have Magisk or if your Magisk version is NA, please refer the video links in the description. Go to Settings. Select Hide the Magisk app. You may need to allow unknown app installation from Magisk. Please give a nice name of your choice. Henceforth the Magisk will be available in this name in your app drawer. This is optional, we can cancel it. Step 3. Configure Deny List. Please open Magisk app. Please remember, we should look for the new name that was given in the previous step. Go to Settings. Enable Zygisk. If at all you don't see this option, maybe you have old version of Magisk, please refer the video link and install the latest version. Please ensure Enforce Deny List is enabled. Tap on Configure Deny List. Go to this three dots menu and enable Show System Apps. Please use this search option and search for Google Play. Over here please select all these apps. Please check at the sub-activity level as well. All these should be enabled. Now look for the actual banking app that is not working. Please do the same for this as well. Step 4. Clear data. Please long press the banking app. Select this app info icon. Go to storage and cache. Please tap on clear storage. This automatically clears cache as well. Step 5. Restart. We are done with all the steps required, it's time to restart your device for these steps to take effect. I have restarted my device. Let me try to open the same app that was giving error before. Yes it works. As you can see, I'm able to use banking apps in my rooted phone. I hope this works for you as well. If you have any questions, please add your comments below, I'll respond to you. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done already. Thank you so much for watching.